House flipping has become a popular and profitable way for women to make a good income and still have time to be a mom. With interest rates low and many moving back to urban areas, many are creating a career. Here's tonight's Smart Woman. Jody Johansson is exploring the Dallas housing market, looking for a good property to renovate and flip for a profit. It's a hot market. Everybody is moving here and staying here. Jody can buy this house for $159,000 and put in $70,000 in renovations and sell it for $299,000. A profit of $70,000 sounds pretty good, but the house is not for Jody. A little bit too much work. According to Realty Track, home flippers reaped in about 30% gross return on their investment during the first quarter it's of this year. Amy Bloom's kids. company, Net Worth Realty, works with investors, especially the growing number of women who want to juggle business with motherhood. Renovating houses has worked for me as a mom. I can spend time in the evenings looking at furnishings and finishes and doing some research on the MLS and what sales prices are. Amy says inexperienced house flippers often underestimate the amount of work needed to renovate a house. They underestimate the amount of cash needed for the job. Another mistake, they hire unreliable contractors and pay them before the job is complete. They overbuild for the neighborhood and they set prices too high. This is move-in ready. You know you're not going to have to put a lot of work into the house. The house was purchased for $71,000. They put 34000 into it, then sold it for 144000 a $30,000 profit for three months' work. My advice is be prepared and have enough money in the bank that if something happens, that it's not going to bankrupt you. For potential home flippers, developing a new team you can trust can be the key to success. Last year, 21% of all of the houses that were flipped were purchased out of foreclosure, but that number is dropping, so investors are looking at other ways to buy discounted property to flip.